on the floor. Hi everyone. As we speak, Dee is running around. On his second lap now. He's not really running, he's jogging to be honest. You can speed that up a bit to be honest. So, I know the date today because tomorrow is the 22nd because I booked us to go to Chick-fil-A in Reading. So I know today must be Thursday the 21st of November 2019 and it's currently 10 past 3 at the moment. He has training at 4 now instead of 5 because he's been moved up a group so we've only got like 15 minutes realistically less than that because we have to pack up and get to the car and then drive to his tennis lesson. So that's all we've, we don't really have a long lesson today maybe 40 minutes if he's lucky. So another short video today and well I had a problem with my booking see so, yeah, we're taking a coach National Express right so I bought the ticket and after I paid it said error and then it didn't save me my ticket that was about four o'clock in the morning but it took the money at my bank so I had to I had to message them on Twitter and then they sorted it out and then gave him my ticket so that sorted out so this whole trip for uh, to chip uh, is it chick-fil-a tomorrow will cost me about 50 pounds because of my son he wants to be a tennis player yeah let's work on that let's work on that movement the forehand see if you don't do it properly D, you're not even doing your hands anymore Good. Right, let's start with four, some forehand, some backhand. Let's warm me up with about five more of this. You want to keep it straight, Dee? Come on, I've seen people control the ball. Sorry. Ow! Dee, I said control the ball, and that's the same time you hit me in the thigh, and that's really painful. I've seen no, don't don't do that. I've seen people be able to just do it straight or diagonally and control where they're going. You're just hitting without thinking. I've said this to you many times. Don't even stand in the middle. Go over there, man, because you can't be trusted with the ball. You need to learn to hit straight. That's too high. Straight across, I said. Come on, you need to learn to hit it straight and stop the curvy, curvy. That's out. You need to control where the ball... Are you actually aiming the ball anyway? Or are you just hitting it? Look at a spot and aim the ball for that. Keep trying until you can aim it at a particular spot. Just keep the ball straight. Keep it going straight. If I said to you, hit it and make it go over there, you should be able to... In fact, I'm going to say hit it and make it go over there. That's out, that's just in. When I say, you have to learn to control it. Over there, back over there. Just in. See, you need to learn to control it. Now I'm back over that side, I want it to go straight along that line. Straight. Good. You need to learn to control it, straight again. You hitting me with no ball. Just in, the balls are getting better. I want it over that side though. Out. I want it over that side and in and far back. Let's try that again. Come forward. Let's pressure when you, the closer you are, let's pressure. That's it. Let's pressure, less energy. Whatever you want to call it. That's better. Another one like that. Right, if you can control the ball, you don't need to hit me, right? Do you? Straight. Out, straight again. You need to know where you got you want the ball to go. You can't just randomly hit the ball. Out, straight in, please. Right, keep it from curving and make it go more like straight like that. 
Right, let's go again. You see where I am? You know to keep the ball away from me. Any time you hit me again, I'm going to be vexed and pack up because that hurts. I didn't sign up for pain. Sign up for you to know to control the ball. You're literally the only one that hits people with the ball. Over that side. Good. Didn't sign up to get hit by a ball. That hurt. My thighs are hurting now. You gotta twist that body, dear. Your stall's not twisting it. That's it. When you do the motion properly, your balls are so much better. Do it so much time that it's like subliminal. Nearly hit me, D. I had to move out the way for that. Straight. Control the ball. You start to hit it again like you're not looking where it's going. That's out. Too far back. We don't want to get it in the light green section, do we? That's good. That was on the line. Come on, control that ball more. Look at it. Angle it. Better. Keep your eye on the ball, angle it. Know where you want it to go. Too high. I told you, when they're too high, they fly like a bird. Keep them straight, keep them nice, leveled. Keep over this side. Need to learn how to control the ball. Go over that side and hit backhand it over this side. Over. Need to get some backhand control. Get out of the way, please. Let's try that again. Backhand control. It's over this line, so I let it count, but more over this side. Right, come on. Backhand control. No, it's over that side. We want it this side, the side that I'm on. Preferably in this, the last box. Out. It's over that side, but it was out. Over that side and in. Backhand. Good. Let's do that again. Backhand, over that side and out. That is out. Over this side and in. Good. Now we're going to do even more ball control with that backhand. We're going to backhand and control it into this box that I'm in. So I'm moving out of that box. Just out, come on. Get it into that box. I've left the box. You sent it to the box I'm in. But I've told you, it's that box. That's why I left that box. Sorry guys, the basket maybe. My gloves off again. It's cold, by the way. Woo. No, that box. Look at it. See where it is. That's it. Do it again. Look at it. See where you want it to go. Come on, higher D. <sighs> right, come on. That's in the wrong box, the front box. Above the baseline, that's it. Not the baseline, the serve line. Net D, come on, angle it up. Backhands always need to be up. Move that body. Wrong box. Right box, well done. Keep it like that, that same energy you're using that gets in that box. I'm going to just stick at the back because it's easier for me to get in. Ray, I told you that already. Nope, not enough energy. Bring it up when it's at the bottom, remember. Good. No, bring it up when it's at the bottom, even with the backhands, D. Let's try that again. Good. Bring it up, even when it's swing it backhand. Good. Oh gosh. Can you guys see him? Last time I, I was recording him, you couldn't see him. Okay. Wrong box. Good. 
Again, backhand. Wrong box. Good, you want them to run. You need to know when you want the, your opponent to run for a ball. Because once he's in the middle, then you, he hits it back to you. You do a long ball and let him run for it. Then if he hits it over you, you come back forward and do a, a volley on him and get his backside out. A drop shot. Good, again. Right, that's it. Control where the ball goes. Once you control where the ball goes, you can control where your opponent goes, right? Control that ball. But it's not controlling the ball. That's over there. Backhand. Too much energy. You knew that was going to go out. Was well, in, but for the purpose of what we're doing, that's out. That was meant to be backhand, and that was a terrible front, uh, forehand because what? You didn't move. Backhand. Back in the box. Out. Not even sending it back to me, you could send it back to me. Oh, poor me, boy. Sorry, guys, just throwing some balls in the basket. Right, we're going to do a quick forehand, backhand, so just get ready to run. I think you're warmed up now. I'm just going to try and see if I can do it. Well, I can zoom in a bit on you, so, but I still catch every angle of the court. Hopefully you guys can you can get to see him more. Right, forehand. No, no, no. My forehand only makes me happy when it's just above the baseline. You know this already. Forehand. Out. Backhand. No. Volley. I like it at the back of the court. Let's keep going. Forehand. Good forehand, please. Deliver it. Move that body. Good. Backhand. Deliver that. Move that body. Great volley. Look where you want it to go. Brilliant. You're getting it now. You can't just willy nilly lick the ball. And I lick the ball, this call a tennis. You're zimmy. You stop. It's the only thing I got from your dad, man. Let me keep the word. You're zimmy. Right, um, forehand, backhand, volley, out, come on, look where you want it, don't just hit the ball, who needs a washing machine or a car when I can take the word, you zimmy, you zimmy, <laughs> forehand, Come on, better forehand, backhand. It's in, but you can do a lot better, right? Volley. Out. All those balls made me upset. Kind of gave me anxiety. I'm not going to lie to you. Forehand. Ooh, that definitely gave me anxiety. Right to the net. Whew. Forehand. Oh, let me get this ball here because there's only three more balls in the basket. D. Anytime you hit in the net, that's anxiety. Anytime you hit outside, it's anxiety. Can you please? I can't even breathe properly because I'm talking about it. Woo! Can you please? Come on. Forehand. Good forehand. Just on the line. A, bit, a little bit up. You know how I like it. That's better. Better. It's fine. It's only been 17 minutes. The camera will tell me. Forehand. Too much energy. Backhand. Volley. That was a bad volley. That was a bad. Come and get the balls. That's a hee hee. Michael Jackson, bad volley. Whew. 
It's 40 past? Yeah. All right, come on then, do it quickly so we can get one more round in. I'm gonna be trying to zip up my coat with my gloves on. I feel like this is Mission Impossible, but I'm gonna try anyway. So guys, as you can tell, there's not gonna be a practice tomorrow because we'll be embarking an unnecessary journey to Reading to get somebody for Chick-fil-A. Sorry guys, but I'll vlog it for you because he's so nice. Apparently he said he's going to vlog, vlog it for you because he's so nice. Y'all want to see Chick-fil-A though? Y'all want to see us travel over two hours for a burger? Really? I want all the videos of Chick-fil-A It's because you're greedy. So tomorrow apparently is an unhealthy day. Not looking forward to that. Don't like unhealthy days. I like sticking to our veg and our, our lean meats, but whatever. Ooh. Although I can eat salmon forever. But tomorrow. It's time for you to pick up those balls in one minute because we're going to run out of time. That's what time it is. So Dante, how do you think you've improved since we first started? Yeah, so what do you think about your practices? Yeah, yeah. So what do you think that you can do to get better? Work harder. Work harder. Maybe push yourself a bit harder, improve that fitness. But are you happy with where you're at so far? What do you got to say if anybody out there is training like you and finding it hard? Because nobody's really showing you the hardness on it, especially on Instagram. They're just showing you the good part where they can hit good, but they don't want to show you the mistake. So what do you have to say to any of the people? Although if you go on our Instagram, at Dante May, you'll see the truth. You see good shots, bad shots. You can even see apparently tears. So what do you have to say if anyone out there is training like you and just feel like they can't do it? So what you got to say to them to inspire them, D? They're looking for a real inspirational world. You cannot be an inspiration leader, boy. It's, 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 it's will I, it's, it's will I always love you. If you're going to sing Whitney Houston and, not, and be inspirational, then at least get the lyrics right. So anyways, because he's incapable of being... Um, he needs to hurry up with a ball. I don't understand how you was over that section and still managed to leave three balls over that side. The way you collect the balls, it will always remain a mystery to me. Hurry up, we don't have much time. We've got about five minutes left. Let's go. So guys, anyways, if you're out there hustling, struggling like us, believe in yourself, never give up. Know that you can do it. Ignore any negativity that's coming your way. Anybody that says you can't do it, and believe in yourself. Everything, if you believe in yourself, anything is possible. Do can you hurry up? We don't have time for your foolishness. Hey, you always have time for hey hey boy. No one has time for hey hey boy, don't they? Ainsley does. <sighs> Sign up for this. It's cold. I don't have time for this. I'm literally in as much clothing as possible. Gloves, scarf. And I'm cold. I don't have time for this. Let's go. Right, let's get you warmed up so when you go to tennis you can hit those balls. So you don't go to the new group and be like, Yo mum, I'm rubbish you. Right, so last practice before you go into your higher group. So let's get this. Forehand. Just in. Out, out, Just in. green, green, light green. Oh, line, Anyways, four hands. It didn't touch the line. You wanted it to touch the line. Told you you need to learn and work on energy. A little bit too much energy, D. Come on. 
That's it, keep that energy. Go again, forehand. See, do, do that hit again, but just put a little bit less energy in it, yeah? Just a little bit. Perfect, yeah, that's the right energy. Let's do that again. Come on, don't fight and overly hit the ball so you get tired. Again, do it like that. Sometimes you hit it hard for no reason. Let the ball fly again. Come on, know the right energy to use. Keep going. Just use a little bit more, not too much. A little bit more. So today you haven't missed the ball and I'm not hearing you complain about dead balls. So do you always only complain when you miss them? No. Okay. So you understand that even the balls that's losing pressure and they're low can still be hit. Right, as long as you understand that. Good. More energy, just a little bit more. You're not swinging your body, Dean. It's not going where I want it to go. Not one of them going to my Goldilocks spot. Right there. You see the difference? Swing that body, it's necessary. Swing that body, it's necessary. Out, D. Even, and you know why? Because you had your hands there, the ball was there. Come on. You wasn't tracking the ball and hitting it according. You see, when you hit it along there, it's always at the right level. Bend. Come on, let's go, move. Move, move, move. That's not a dead ball. See your back? That, that barely made it across. Move that body. Good. It's absolutely imperative. Come on, you see, you didn't move your body, it didn't go anywhere. You, you kicked your leg up in the air. You can always tell the ones that you don't move properly for. Are you looking for where your ball wants to go? Because you don't look like you're controlling the ball. Better. Look where you want it to go. Bro, that was a backhand that you did not control. Backhand straight. That's kind of not straight. Straight would be straight across. Straight backhand. No. Straight backhand. Better. Straight backhand. No. Straight backhand. Straight backhand. Out. Straight backhand. Good. Wait, your bounce is a very important. Wait for the right time to hit it. Good. Wait for the right time. I told you this yesterday. There's a right time to hit it. That's it. Two seconds after the bounce. One, two. That's it. Too much power. Get in the Goldilocks time. Goldilocks. I had to move at the weight, otherwise that would have hit me right in the chest. Right, Goldilocks. Let's try that again. Goldilocks. Nope, you was a bit late. Right on the, right on the Goldilocks point. Boom. You're not looking where you want it to go, you're just hitting again. Looking where, where you want it to go, aim it. You can aim it. Oh. Come on, D. What's going on? What are you doing? You're just making it go straight across. Keep to your normal routine and thingy. That's it. Keep to what you're doing before, but aim it straight, D. Just tilt your body. What time is it? It's enough time, don't worry. Watch your body. Better. You just have to move your body a little bit to get it straight. Just a little bit. Try again. Just a little bit. See? Use your body a little bit again. Little bit. Bring
brilliant bang on you see a little bit you're moving your body too much a little bit perfect move it a little bit again well done a little bit too much energy a little bit right we've got last few balls let's end wow. with that's a beautiful straight one let's end with forehand backhand volley and then we're done are you sure because i don't want to be late you're not going to be late d hurry up quickly good come on let's go back into position come on last few balls forehand backhand brilliant No, volley. Come on, D. Stay focused. Know where you want the ball to go. That's out. You're not focusing. We've got more than enough time. Tennis is just literally two, drive, two minutes drive, D. Come on. Forehand. Good. Backhand. You need to learn to run faster, D. Come on. Come on. Back into position. Volley. The longer you take, the, lo the more you're going to be late. Come on. Don't want to be late. Good. Come on, let's move. Pack up in three minutes. That's it. It's a two minutes drive. Out, come on, focus on where you want it to go, D. Let's go. Last two, three rounds. Forehand. No, you're not focusing on where you want it to go. Backhand. Hope you play better than this in Twingy. Volley. Come on, move, move. I'm hot. I'm really hot. Then take your coat off, D. Come on, we've got to go. The last two rounds. Right. Two more rounds left. Come on, get all of these balls. Forehand. Backhand. Volley. Good. All in, last round, make it count. You're gonna do two forehand in this one. Forehand, forehand again. Backhand. Volley. Oh, unfortunate. Right, that's it, let's pack up. Get the bag. Get the balls over this side. I think no, I'll just get that. Really? Because it's faster. Because you take so long. No. Right, make sure you get it in two minutes then, please. Hurry up. I need you to be really, really fast. I'll film you. Buckle? Cool? Ooh, why is this upside? Oh, perfect. Come on, move. You got to move like your, your tennis dreams are on the line. Oh, look, you've only got five minutes left. Me a film me to box foot. Me look like me a, me a slave. Sure. Yeah, like she's the worst mom, isn't it? I'm practicing my Spielberg. To the left, to the left. I'm directing you to pick up the ball. You gotta be faster. You gotta do it with more emotion, more heart. Come on. I wanna see you pick up that, 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 those balls with great speed. I want you to pretend that you're the flash. I want you to pretend that you've got five minutes and every time you take long, you're gonna be late for your new um, class. Because? Why did you leave that ball? I'll never understand how you pick up the balls. Look at that ball. He was just over there, right? He picked up all the balls, but look at this one dead ball. Why does he do that? Cleared up all the other balls, and he was right next to it. And then he goes over to here. No. no, I'm good. All right, come and pick up these ones, because you're taking long. Here. Because ain't nobody got time for this. 
Really? You're taking so long here. Mm. I don't understand the way you pick up the balls though. Realistically. Why don't you just get that one up? Look, you left one over there as well. Why? I don't know if I got myself in a camera, but I can edit that out. <sighs> the last two balls. And done. Right, Moo, let's go. Let's, Bye, let's wrap up the vlog. Okay guys, that's the end of the lesson, quick lesson like I said to you. Um, today we just worked a little bit of forehand, a little bit of backhand, a little bit of volley again. Um, mainly focusing on forehand, a little bit of back and backhand, not really much the volley. But that's it, um, we're going to head off now to tennis with his culture session. I'll try and see if I can record um, some as usual and post it on Instagram at Don So until next time, take care of yourselves and each other. 